Sweaty. <laughs> oh, it's <that's> funny. <laughs> what if I was a cowboy? Like my sister's room. <laughs> Stop! Stop! Please. Dad? The heck? Just shut the hell up. Seriously. What are you. I don't even know what you're. What are you doing in here? Who the heck are you? That doesn't really matter. Just stop that. You're being a freak. What? Why are you even. Why do you care how I want to live my life? I can do whatever I want to do. Who cares if I'm in my sister's room? Why? How'd you even get in my house? Oh my gosh. Mom, there's a stranger. Josh, stop, stop. Shh. Remember? You pay me to be here. You said whenever you start doing something weird that you're going to give me five bucks to stop you. And I rode my moped like 20 miles to get here, so you better pay out, man. And you better stop doing this, because I'm not going to ride here every time, okay? Oh, yeah. Just five bucks. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry about freaking you out. <laughs> Stop being so weird, okay? I'm not gonna yeah. come here every time. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Stop! Sorry. It's okay. It's hot out. <sighs> Can't keep doing this. Time's free. Next time it's gonna charge you, so just walk normal. Okay. And that was the first time I met Buck Pierce. A crazy old fool teach me right, opposed to wrong. But he was a lonely bastard living a lonely life. The second time I saw him, well, unfortunately, that was the last. Met him outside of Memphis in a little town called Rosewood. I decided to give him a ride because he was short on gas. And then, guys, can I be done with this? Okay, bye. Mom, help me!